Hello folks, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I'm gonna show you how you can build a powerful automation with AI to automate the process of creating a newsletter. So if you are sending out newsletter to your audience, or even if you are sending out articles, or if you are creating content, this video could be extremely helpful for you to understand how you can combine automation with AI to create content and to select the best content to add to your newsletter. This is one automation that I did for one of my clients in the real estate industry, and it's extremely helpful for you to start creating more content and reaching out to your audience. Let's get started. So here is a great use case when you combine automation with AI. Of course, this use case is to create a monthly newsletter, okay? So it's a monthly newsletter which highlights the most important news articles for the past month and dividing in different categories okay so the way that i've built this automation for one of our clients is i'm using fiddly to get news from specific media sources that i wanted to track like cnbc like forbes and some other ones and of course in this case it's more related to real estate so there are some media sources that are more connected to our real estate news. And basically what I'm doing here is receiving all the news articles here and I'm adding some filters. So there are some media sources that I don't wanna, I don't want to track. There are some keywords that I don't need. For example, in this case, we are doing this for a commercial real estate company. So they don't want to add uh, residential real estate articles to the newsletter, right? So I'm kind of removing some keywords and then I'm using OpenAI to analyze the article, right? So I need to understand, is this a local news or is this a national news, okay? Because on the newsletter, we have different sections for national news and we have a section for local news to one specific city that this commercial real estate works, okay? So I'm using OpenAI to analyze the article and to understand is this a notional or a local news. Based on the answer, I'm dividing this automation into two different steps here. The first step, of course, is for national news. And for national news, I want to evaluate why, what is the impact of these news articles to the economy, to the national economy of the United States, right? And based on the answer, I'm starting to rate the articles, right? And of course, I don't want to have articles that are like zero or one in terms of zero to five impact on the national economy, right? So, and then I'm adding those articles into a database and I'm doing the exact same thing for the local news. So when this is a, a local news, I'm analyzing the impact of that local news into that specific city and then adding that article into a database. So here on this database, you have all the articles, you have the categories. So another thing that I'm doing here is to get the category of the article. Is this about the economy? Is this about the industrial real estate? Is this about office real estate? So then, because again, on the newsletter, we have different sections depending on the category as well. Okay, so I'm creating this large database here and we have the rates here for each article. We have the URL, we have the media source, we have the title, we have the category and everything and the dates, of course, and everything that we need here. And then I have a second scenario here on make.com is to fetch and get all that news articles and to select the top five most important ones to that specific month, okay? So we can add those articles into the newsletter. And what I'm doing here, so for the national economy, I'm running, I'm also using, of course, OpenAI to select the top five most relevant articles here. And also for the output should be on the exact same structure that I need to add to the newsletter, right? So I need the title to be 
On top, I need the, um, to have an HTML tag so it can be a clickable title to the URL of that article and also a very short summary of that article. So the output of this is five articles with the URLs and summaries for each article ready to just be added to the newsletter. And I'm doing this for the national economy. I'm doing this for our local industry properties. I'm doing this for local office properties, okay? And then once we have the output for each category, then I ask OpenAI to write a overall summary of all the articles for that specific newsletter. So it's gonna be the summary that's gonna start the newsletter, it's gonna, that's gonna be on top of the newsletter that you need to, to use to then, of course, pass through this. And for this specific case, we also we are also taking a screenshot of the interest rates from one particular website. So we are taking this screenshot and we are also adding that screenshot to the newsletter. So the output of this automation is a newsletter with an overall summary with a top five articles per section, per category, with title, with URL, and with a short summary, and a screenshot of the interest rates. That's, of course, it's relevant to this newsletter audience that cares about real estate, right? And then we are adding all of that to MailChimp. So my client is using MailChimp to send out the newsletter, and we are passing all this data through MailChimp and creating a new campaign there with all the relevant data so the client can just review it and send the newsletter out to his audience. So um, hope you like this video. Hope you now understand just with another example, how powerful it is when you combine automation with AI. So if you wanna create a similar automation to your company, if you need help by doing so, just click on the link down below so we can get on a call and I can show you one or more examples of how this kind of system works and how this kind of system can help you scale your company. And if you are not there yet, just click on this video on another example of a powerful system using automation. Thank you.